Hey guys, today we're back with another shoe review. And today on the channel, we'll be doing the range review on the CZ Custom Shop Accu Shadow 2. Stay tuned for this one. <laughs> All right, guys, we're back. Once again, today we're going to be doing a shoot review on the CZ Accu Shadow 2. This is uh, the Custom Shop CZ Accu Shadow 2. Uh, it looks a lot like the CZ uh, Shadow 2, but uh, this is indeed the Custom Shop one. The Accu Shadow uh, comes with three 17 round mags from the factory, as you can see. A bushing wrench. Some tools here uh, a different uh, safety uh, lever the one I've got on it right now is the flat one this is one more if you want to conceal carry it I've got one more with a ledge on it that would uh, be more for competition shooting maybe something to rest your finger on your thumb on whenever you're shooting and uh, some bushing pads and in here we have the CZ target which is five rounds fired Single action on this uh, is three and a half pounds. The double action is eight and a half pounds. Test fired by Tyler, expected, inspected by Eric Zinn, I guess is how you uh, pronounce his name. But it appears how it looks on target. As you can see, very tight group. Go ahead and put this back in here. And just uh, information for the books and everything else. If you want a little bit more in depth uh, unboxing review, you can check that out. But we'll go ahead and jump right into the shoot review. So guys, the interesting, most interesting thing I can say about this gun right here is that it is 100% the most accurate gun I've ever shot. Uh, the CZ Accu Shadow 2 uses the bushing barrel top system as you would see in a 1911 and gun is, on, is empty. But anyway, uh, it uses the bushing in the front as you would on a traditional 1911 as you've seen from many of them. Uh, that's how they claim this CZ has its best accuracy is with that. Uh, what CZ claims is that this gun will show uh, sub three inch uh, groups at 50 yards and I can 100% contest to that. This right here is 100% the most accurate handgun I've ever had. I actually had the TSO, uh, Tactical Sport Orange, and uh, I love that gun, don't get me wrong. But uh, to me, I uh, had a little bit too light of a trigger the way it was set up. And uh, also on it, it was nowhere, it was accurate, but it wasn't as accurate as this gun right here. This is, like I said, the most accurate gun I've ever had in comparison with, say, uh, Wilson Combat, CQB, CQB Elite. Um, Let's see here, what else have I had by Wilson? Uh, shot the Vickers Elite. Also had an Ed Brown Cobra, uh, sorry about that. And it, uh, I've also had a Dan Wesson Custom Kodiak that I had built while I was in Academy. And that is a very accurate gun, but none of them actually stand up to how accurate this gun right here has been. Uh, has an extended mag release, as you can see. Shoots them out very quick, very easy. No, uh, no uh, stopping with that or anything like that. Very, very nice gun overall. I mean, I'm kind of at a loss of words for it, as you all have known. Anytime I get a gun, I'm really crazy over it. I get a loss of words over it. But uh, this gun right here really is something else. The single action on this gun is the best I've ever felt of any kind of semi-automatic. Doesn't matter if it is a uh, 1911 or whatever else. This has the best uh, single action I've ever felt. Breaks just like a piece of glass. Double action is very good as well. Probably the best double action I've ever felt on a uh, pistol also. Very smooth all the way through. You can keep it right on target and it pulls perfectly. I like the round trigger on it. I thought I would uh, might have some problems with round trigger because I do most of the time, but now this right here feels perfect in my hand. Just a very, very nice gun overall. But like I said, this gun right here has the uh, bush and barrel inch where it will have sub three inch groups at uh, at 50 yards and that's that's just unheard of also has a tack rail so if you'd like to put a light on it be a very nice gun for not only competition shooting and uh, accuracy shooting but also a home defense gun 17 rounds nine millimeter is uh, pretty much what you already expect now as a, out of a full-size pistol and uh, this gun right here with the tack rail on the bottom of it you can put a light or laser or light or laser combo and uh, it would run very well and you can also set this gun up 
uh, to carry like a 1911, throw one in the chamber, throw the safety on, and there you go, you're ready to rock and roll. And then also you can actually take it, throw one in it, and then let the hammer down real easy and you can carry it in double action because like I said earlier, that is also a double action pistol. So that first shot would be double action and then next follow up shots would be single action. So it just depends on how you would wanna carry this gun. But now guys, I'm telling you something, this right here really is the most accurate pistol I've ever owned. Done uh, some accuracy testing to see what I would uh, get from it. After I found out where to hold, I'm telling them the bullets you can see for yourself after uh, the video gets done shooting that uh, how very well close them bullets was together. And uh, like I said, I, I sit back also at 50 yards and shot it. And, th and this gun, I could hit the man-sized target almost every time. It, uh, it really is something else, and I'm just being dead honest with you guys. Coming in at about around $2,200 MSRP, and that's now what they've been selling for. Uh, this gun right here, if you're wanting to invest that type of money in it, I mean, I've even heard a bit out shooting 2011s, and you know how well them were supposed to be for competition shooting and everything else. But now this, this gun right here really is. I mean, even the ergonomics of it, CZ's ergonomics is known worldwide for how well it fits in your hand, fits like a glove. It's like you have took a piece of, I guess you would say, uh, mold or anything else, stuck your hand in it, squeezed it as hard as you could in a pistol grip, and that is exactly what they've done with this. Just uh, unheard of ergonomics, anybody beating them. I love the CZ grips on it, very thin. I mean, it's a thin gun in your hand, and it just works for me perfect. But guys, if you're interested in this gun, I 100% recommend it. I know that's a very high price on this. But uh, unlike, you know, some of my other videos with Wilson Combat and everything else where, you know, uh, is it worth the money and everything else, this one right here is 100% worth the money. I've uh, actually been looking for this gun for many years now, probably two years at least, and I've never been able to find one used. I actually bought this one used myself, and the guy I bought it off of had only shot one mag through it, and I got a really good deal on it, enough to where I could keep it and not have to ever worry about selling or anything else. And I'm telling you, this will be one that I'll keep on the channel from here on out. It's just, it's way too accurate of a pistol for me not to keep. I mean, this right here wins competitions. That five inch barrel, you couldn't ask for anything else. And I'm telling you guys, this, this is a very nice pistol. I, I can't say any anything else about it that I don't like. I mean, I'm sitting here trying to think of, of any con of this gun besides maybe the price, but I mean, at that point, I think it's 100% worth the price myself, but it really is a masterpiece of a handgun, the only way I can tell you guys. But uh, I appreciate y'all viewing. If you have any questions or comments about the CZ Accu Shadow, let me know what you think about it, and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm just sitting here trying to rack my brain on anything that I can think of that might be a positive or negative about this gun, and I can't think of one single thing about it, bad to say about it, and that's really it. Maybe, possibly, it's a little bit harder to rack where the slide is in the actual frame of the gun, uh, but that's just a product of the beast itself. But I mean, I've never had no problems with my hand slipping off of it or anything else, and, and like I said, guys, this it's a great pistol. It really is. You guys, I appreciate y'all viewing. I hope y'all enjoy the video. Uh, check out my merchandise on Teespring if you'd like to. Also, uh, subscribe and make sure that you check out for more other videos. I should already have the unboxing review uh, for this one up. So check that out if you haven't already. But guys, I appreciate y'all viewing. Like and subscribe for more gun reviews. And I'll see y'all in the next video.
Hey guys, thank you for sticking around to the end of the video. I'd like to make a quick shout out to Hero Soap Company for sponsoring my channel. Uh, Hero Soap Company does a one-one ratio with their soap lines, with their subscriptions to where if you subscribe to their soap every single month, uh, you will get a, a delivery of soap in the mail once a month. And not only that, but they will also send a one-one ratio of the soap you purchase overseas to a soldier in need. Not only that, but some of their profits that they make from their subscription lines will go to soldiers and first responders such as law enforcement, EMS, and fire in need, and will go to multiple other different uh, actual charities involving first responders and veterans. So guys, it's very good quality, very good company, and if you'd like to check them out, go to the description below and uh, find my link, and you can use that and go into their website and make sure that you type in Golden Web at the end, and it will give you 10% off, but just want to make a quick shout out to Hero Soap Company and giving them a special thank you. So guys, appreciate y'all viewing, and I will see you all in the next video.